Your teacher today is Dr. Bosa Science. Dr. Bosa is a teacher at the Science Foundation College, the best school that teaches sciences. Today we are going to study A level physics. Lesson 17 The structure and action of AC transformer. The AC transformer is illustrated below. VP is the primary voltage. VS is the secondary voltage. The transformer consists of two coils of insulated wires. The primary and secondary wound on laminated soft iron core. When alternating current VP is connected to the primary coil, it drives an alternating current in the primary coil. The alternating current produces a varying magnetic flux phi p that link the primary coil inducing a back emf eb in the primary coil the varying magnetic flux phi s links the secondary coil by mutual induction all inducing alternating voltage Vs in the secondary. Vp is equal to Np d phi p dt equation 1. Vs is equal to Ns d phi p dt equation 2. Dividing equation 1 by equation 2 Vp over Vs is equal to Np over Ns. When Ns is greater than Np, the transformer is a step up when Ns is less than NP, the transformer is a step down. Example 1. Explain why the voltage at generating power station must be stepped up to very high value for long distance transmission. 3. Max. Solution. Transmission at high voltage reduces power loss. Note that Power supply in P is equal to I V, implying that I is equal to P over V. Hence, when V is high, I is small. From power loss, P dash is equal to I squared R. When I is small, power loss is reduced. Example 2. A transformer connected to AC supply of peak voltage 240V is to supply a peak voltage of 90V to mini lighting system of resistance 5 ohm. Calculate 1. RMS current 
supplied to the lighting system to max VR MS is equal to V naught over root 2 IR MS is equal to V R MS over R is equal to V naught over root 2 R is equal to 9.0 over 5 root 2 which is equal to 1.27 amps to average power delivered to the lighting system to max P is equal to I squared R is equal to I squared R M S times R is equal to 1.27 squared times 5 which is equal to 8.1 watts example 3 explain why the current in the primary coil of a transformer increases when the secondary is connected to the load when the load is connected to the secondary winding a current flows in it the current flows in such a direction as to reduce the back emf in the primary coil hence the current in the primary coil increases energy losses in a transformer and how they are reduced heat is dissipated in the winding by I squared R mechanism this is minimized by use of low resistance thick copper wires energy losses resulting from loss of flux of flux leakage this is minimized by winding secondary coil on primary coil free energy is lost due to adding currents this is minimized by laminating the core for energy is lost due to friction this is minimized by replicating the rubbing parts energy is lost by asteresis asteresis loss is the energy required for constant reversal of magnetic domain pole due to the changing magnetic flux created by an AC current. Hysteresis loss is minimized by use of a core made of self magnetic substance which requires very little energy to create magnetic reversals such as soft iron Transformer. A transformer is used to step up or down voltage to shoot the required appliance.
appliances that may require a transformer include telephone, radio, loudspeaker, x-ray machines, TV, and so on. AD currents. If a block of metal is moved in magnetic field or kept in a changing magnetic field, free electrons in the conductor experience a force and begin to saturate. This gives rise to induced current in a closed circular path known as eddy currents. These currents flow in such a direction as to oppose the motion of a conduct in the field. Eddy currents produce a large amount of heat in the soft iron core of transformers and other electronics and thus reduce the efficiency of electrical devices. Uses of eddy currents. One, damp oscillation is in a moving coil galvanometer preventing oscillation of the pointer and lead to accurate readings. Eddy currents produce enough heat to melt metals in induction furnace. Electric brakes. The arc zero of a train is surrounded by coaxial cylindrical drum. When the train is to be stopped, a strong magnetic field is applied to the rotating drum. This generates large eddy currents that oppose motion of the axis. Four, speedometer. Eddy currents are used in speedometers.